Good morning! Hi, my name is Amanda Freeman and I am the Pearson Campus Ambassador at Westchester University. I am officially a senior today because it's officially the first day of class and I'm a math major with minors in digital marketing and dance. So a little bit all over the place, but I am so excited to share more about me, take you around my campus, take you what it's like to be a golden man for a day. So let's get started. So the first thing I'm gonna do, because I just finished my first class of the day, I only have one uh, synchronous class on Mondays. So I'm gonna make my bed and then we're gonna make some breakfast. Okay, so before we make breakfast, I'm just going to take you through a little tour of my apartment and so you can see a little bit better. So this is my room. I have my desk and here's the bed I just made, my cabinet and some pictures. And then on this side, this is our bathroom and I actually just installed those shelves yesterday. So I love the color pink. If you can't tell, my whole bathroom is pink. <laughs> then over there, that is my roommate's room. She's currently in class. And this is an empty bedroom we have. We have some cute little wall decor just to kind of brighten up the space. So this is the kitchen where I'll be making my eggs this morning for breakfast. And I don't know if you guys can see, but we still have our Christmas decorations up and it's in the end of January so later in this video <laughs> we'll have these taken down but see our Christmas tree so this is our living room we like to dance in here we have a great view our little dining room and now let's get cooking in the kitchen so today for breakfast we're gonna have some eggs so I'm going to make eggs toast and bananas, which is what I usually have for breakfast every morning. Let's see. Okay, now we're back. We're fueled up, ready to go for the day. So now because the first day of class, it's super important to get organized on the first day. So you set yourself up better for the rest of the semester. So what I have is my planner and I rely on this thing so much. If you don't have a planner, I definitely recommend getting one. So I like to organize my planner. You can see here I have first day of class because, you know, it's a new year, a new start, and you know, you just have to go into every every class with a positive attitude. So a big suggestion that I have, or something that works for me, doesn't necessarily mean it would work for you, is I like to print out all my syllabuses, either you know, the day of class, the day before class, or as soon as they're uploaded to our learning management system, which Westchester uses D2L. So you can see these are all our classes uploaded onto D2L. So what I like to do is go through each of my syllabuses and just kind of highlight any information that, you know, is about dates, about deadlines, about homeworks, stuff like that. And then I like to put that in my planner so I know for the rest of the semester I have everything that's on my syllabus and I put it right here in my planner. So let's get organized. Okay, so now that I have all my dates and everything put into my planner, I was just going to show you what I like to do for my notebook and for organizing my classes throughout the semester. So as you can see here, I laid out all my journals and notebooks. I kind of like everything color coordinated, so you know, blue notebook, blue folder, blue tab, and then I have all my syllabuses above it. So. I like to lay out the colors so I know which class is which day um, and you know it just helps me stay organized that way so okay so now I'm gonna take you on a nice little walking tour so it's very cold out today so we are going to wear our jackets and go explore Wishes Universe. okay so the first building on our walking tour is the Eobo building you can see here this is the building that houses the arts and music. And like I said before, 
I am a dance minor, so this is where the dance studio is, all our dance classes, and um, there's like drama buildings and stuff like that. So pretty much the artsy side of campus is over here. Okay, so now we are headed to the library. And as you can see, the library is six floors and each floor is a different quiet zone. So on the bottom floor, you'll usually find like people doing group work, stuff like that. And then at the very top, it's completely silent, no sound allowed, stuff like that. So as you get higher, it gets quieter. Um, I do like to come here sometimes to study. Most of the time I come do it in my room, but if I have to check out a book or something, this is where I go. Staff is super friendly, so this is the library. So this is my favorite spot on campus. This is the quad. There's a little dog playing frisbee here today. Not very busy, but basically in the spring, you'll find a ton of people here um, doing activities, doing studying. So these are all the main buildings. Here we have main hall and the arts building, the teacher building, and then again, this is the library. So there's a plethora of different buildings right at the center of campus, really great place to come and study. So next up we have the famous Rami statue. So Westchester University, the mascot is the golden ram. So this is the famous Rami statue. So on a typical day, you'll see, you know, tours here, people getting pictures here. Um, I have a picture from the first admissions day here. So it's really kind of monumental and it sits right at the center of campus. So you'll see people here all the time. Like I said, because of COVID, we're all online, so not a super busy day. Okay, but. so before I show you the next building, which is actually a building very near and dear to my heart, we are passing the Student Union Building. So this is where Chick-fil-A is, my favorite. And actually our campus bookstore is in the bottom of the book, is the bottom of the Student Union. There's three levels, study zones. This is where our tutoring is. So really a great place to go and hang out meet new friends and get some amazing food. Okay, so this building behind me is one of the most uh, places that touches my heart the most because this is where I lived freshman year of college. And I love it so much because I met some of my very best friends here who I'm still super close with to this day. So if it wasn't for this building, you know, who knows who I'd be friends with. So I'm really grateful. Also, I wanted to show you behind me. It's kind of hard to see, but there's some construction happening. And that's because Westchester is actually having opening a new building. And in this new building, it's gonna be called the Science and the Commons Building. So it's a super new, cool, high-tech building that's gonna house our uh, new cafeteria, put new offices in, um, give space for the nursing and engineering majors. And it's just gonna be the newest, coolest place on campus. So it should be opening in the fall. It was delayed obviously due to COVID, but I'm super excited to see how this turns out um, when we come back in the fall. So I just wanted to show you a little bit better perspective. This is the construction. It's gonna be super cool. So our final stop on our tour today, this is Lawrence Hall. And this is where the cafeteria is. So on a typical school year, after class, I would come here for lunch, dinner, sometimes breakfast. Um, this is also where you can get resources and help. Some teacher offices are in here. And also just down there, there's the most amazing bagel place. So if you're ever on campus and want a bagel, Einstein Bagels, you should definitely check it out. So that concludes our tour. I will meet you back in my room to wrap up. We are back in my room after that cold walk back. It's 30 degrees outside today, so it's not the most pleasant walk, but we did it. Um, I just wanted to say thank you so much for tuning in to my video. I hope I showed you a little bit about my first day of class. I'm super excited for this school year. I hope you are too. It's a fresh start. Make it a great year. Um, possibilities are endless, so who knows what you can accomplish. As always, make sure to subscribe to our channel at Pearson Students on YouTube for more fun content coming your way. Have a great year and go Rams!